Well, hello, all my wonderful builders out there. Caddy with you today, and, uh, well, this is a set I got for Christmas this year, and, uh, figured I'd show it off. It's a, um, a house out of the, uh, line that came out in 2021 with a chunk of road attached to it, and, obviously, chunk of road. <laughs> um, I think it was the smallest of the three sets that had a piece of road, this being the, uh, family home. Uh, so let's take a nice closer look here. It's getting close. First off, out front on the road here, we have a dad and a kid, each uh, wearing roly skates and having hockey sticks. There was an extra little black hockey puck side. They're each holding one end. Uh, the little goals are attached on with the couple of dot pieces on the road, so. At least they'll stay put whenever they're, whenever I'm trying to not do that one-handed and looking sideways. Um, <laughs> just like on display or if things get jostled. Uh, there is a car, a family roadster as it were, which uh, yeah, can fit a couple people in there. It's a uh, pop-off roof. But yeah. I don't think you can get the whole crew in, especially since one person. Yeah, you can, you can sit two people in there. <laughs> um, well, that's fine. Not expecting the world out of the cars. They never are big enough for everything, except for every once in a while. Um, and it's an electric car, and you can tell that because it's got a pluggy on the back. Moving right along here on the downstairs area. We have a bit of an outside space. Um, they, the dad and kid have a uh, non-helmet version, so there's a, a hair and a hat in there and a, a scrub brush. And there's a um, doggy do on the ground. Uh, there is a little uh, Labrador Retriever. Oh, you keep looking at that. Actually, a nice little option. Jago type we didn't have before as I try and replace him while I can't see right, because I'm looking through the viewfinder. Eh. <laughs> I can't do this sideways. There we go. Actually, look at the thing. Cute little lab. And uh, interesting piece that came with the young girl. Short legs that are bendable. They're longer than the other short legs, but at least... She can sit on her butt. Um, and one thing I don't particularly care for, I feel this looks messy. It looks like a hot mess, this hat with hair. It just has, it, it is just way too much going on. It's, it, it's, that is, that is much too big. But, um, you know, I can't say Lego's going to do everything right. Garden there growing something. This is the, um, Recharge station for our electric car there. It's got a little pop-out cable you plug into the bum of the car um, Picnic table it Could Probably yeah, you can't actually get four people there because you can't get two people sitting next on the dots It was a hot dog and a drink I don't know what you're supposed to put in the little bucket or what that concept is, but there's a wrench hanging out there <sighs> Moving right back along Little carport area there. Some siding, you know, just for looks. On the first floor here, we have a bit of a kitchen action. There's a, it's hard to see, but there, there is a frying pan there. And for some reason, there's an apple and I'm guessing a smoothie machine and uh, two glass doors. One, I'm guessing. This doesn't make a lot of sense either. Uh, is one the refrigerator and one the oven? Or what do we got going on there? But really cool bit. On the couch, there is a video game controller. It is a molded piece with printed stuff on it. So that is actually pretty nifty. And the on the screen, it's playing a Ninjago uh, game. And uh, Junior here that was the son has a Ninjago shirt. So... He's a fan of Lego things. Move up to the deck here where mom is hanging out. 
I don't know how she got out there since there's no stairs, no door, or anything. She just magically teleports up there to the grill. Where they're grilling up a single chicken leg to enjoy. Mm -mm. Um, and some flowers on the uh, outside there. More paneling. Might as well do the rest of the outside front. And some solar panels on the top. Go to the bum side here. There's a, uh, a shower. I guess that's a sink. Toilet. In this room, there's some stuff hung up on the wall. So they had towels and washer hands listed there. Cool. Got a little, uh, looks like a stereo and a paintbrush. And, um, guitar. So kind of a little rec room there, and up top we have the uh, the boudoir um, with a uh, nicely built bed, a poster for I'm guessing that's Ninjago esque sword. It's one of those slice uh, slitty pieces there to make a radio and a, a little statue, a little like trophy guy. And I knocked Dad over as I was spinning it around. Dad, stand up. You drunk. <sighs> the car has a nice little place to park, which is cool. So overall, I'd say this is a pretty nice set. Um, interestingly, if you notice, there's gray separation between the floors. Uh, this is built like the uh, disassemblable buildings uh, from recent years. Uh, so I don't know for sure if it's the same length. It looks like it. I haven't built one of those in a while, so I can't be sure. But all the floors above the first one pop off like that. Um, so you can rearrange stuff. Like, you know, the building part over here and the little terrace over there. You may want to rearrange it sideways so the rail is on the side where to be outside. But, you know, that, that's easy enough to deal with. Um... It's not exactly like this part's a complicated build. Oh my, this bar comes off. <laughs> as I take apart half the building as I, you know, just point at it. Um, Dad's not being fallen over. Um, but yeah. So you may be able to uh, use this in a conjunction with some of your other uh, peaceable buildings. If you want to add more rooms or to it or to them with this thing. But it's a nice modern house. While I'm sitting here, I'll uh, scooch slightly over to my right. And uh, I did also get the uh, advent calendar for this year. The regular Lego one. Let's see if I can see everything. There's a lady with a, just a criminal lady. There's a chimney with a little F on it. I, I don't understand. Um, a lot of things were small builds, so monster truck. It was a firefighter dude. He, he's cool. Um, some nerdy guy caroling. Good for him. Snowman. I mean, these these are your little daily diddles. So I'm not expecting the world. It's a trash truck. It was supposed to be picking up the poops. I just put them on top of the truck. There was the train engine. That was one day. The train car was another day. And Santa was a third day. So this little trio was three days worth of presents. Um, a little tree. A little... Uh, North Pole with a letter and a lamp on it. Now, not everything, even if it is in of itself exciting, potentially could be um, useful for other bits like special parts and or um, useful pieces like the letter or the lamp. Those are definitely cool. This is a, I think it's supposed to be a semi truck with it's carrying a ramp, which you take off and the little monster truck supposed to jump on it teeny tiny hospital I mean again it has a syringe on it so that's a usable part elsewhere um 
little fire department. Um, so I, I don't understand the X thing on the top, but hey, it's not my job to understand everything. A little kind of Christmas dinner, I think, I guess. Cool. Um, a um, cleanup worker who has a bottle, so she's um, drunk. Good for her. I know this was a single day. It was a toy workbench with a little rubber ducky and a little toy boat. So we were building two things at the same time here. Uh, the little rubber ducky is a really cute little piece sculpt. It will not focus on him, though, because reasons. Ah, there we go. A little pink version hammer, so something to work with. Uh, this shovel came with the um, garbage truck day. Again, useful parts. Um, fire helicopter. Um, police officer. Who who is um, playing hockey with the criminal for some reason. But again, police officer. Regular, ordinary officer outfit. All you got to do is take the, the ice skates off his feet and boom, he's got. <clears throat> Bonus um, handcuffs from something. <clears throat> again, useful pieces. Ah, uh, That's what I came extra with. The police car construct. I think this was day one. It was um, the city bus. Almost done here. There was a car wash and uh, the brush piece, which not very common bit. Um, the ambulance with uh, it's got a cast on the back of it that, that fits on a Lego person's hand, so they look like they have a cast. And I believe that was all the days. Um, so yeah, a little bonus there from, uh, Primus that's all just been sitting on my desk for the last, well, month as I slowly built through my calendar. <laughs> but yeah, between those and, uh, the little Lego house, I hope you've uh, enjoyed this. So, uh, built this easy in one day without really pushing a lot of time. It's five building sets, so... Five little chunks of building. First set was the car and two people. And then each other of the four sections was mostly a floor. Um, well, the first floor was two sections of building. Then one section and one section for the top floor. So middle floor and top floor were each a section. And the top floor also included adding the piece of road on the front. Yep. Again, really easy build. Uh, didn't take long to deal with. Um, and uh, was a quick to do. Uh, probably the smallest of the Lego sets. Least complicated. I think the one other one's a little smaller, but uh, least complicated of the Lego sets I got for Christmas. <laughs> uh, but don't worry. There's more interesting things to come, and uh, we'll, we'll cover those. For now, thank you for enjoying some Legos with me. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and uh, hit that little dingly bell for the little dingly bell. Let you know when I post new videos. Could be more Legos. I do have a few to build in the next coming couple of months. Uh, and of course, uh, don't forget both my Patreon link and my coffee link are in the description box below. Both of which are good ways to help support me and my channel. And it helps me make better videos for you, my constructive public. So for now, see you next time, and uh, happy building.